So I'm uh, just started recording it. So you know, hopefully we'll hear Kisha. Kisha, are you ready? You're sir. You're searching for something. I don't know what you're searching for. You know, in the last minute. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> okay, Kesha, we are ready for you. Uh, who is this making noise? Joel, that's okay. Joel can make noise. Oh, perfect. Huh? Um, uh, thank you, uh, Madam Joel, for the conversation that we've had on, uh, on the LinkedIn. And, um, as you requested that we set up a meeting for uh, for for a presentation of what uh, we can do for your company, uh, then you'll allow me to share with you my screen. Very good. So far, so good. Amazing. Yeah. yeah. Um, hi, hi, kids. Uh, thank you. It's it's a pleasure to meet you as well. We have been talking uh, for quite long and I'm um, keen to know more about uh, your work and everything after hearing several times and getting some messages from you. And uh, please go ahead and share your screen. And yeah, it's okay. That's perfect. What's happening? <clears throat> yes, you'll um, allow me. I think you're able to see my screen. Uh, yes, slowly it is coming up. Yes, yes, it is coming up. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, all right. Uh, you'll allow me to take you a little bit back on uh, how the step up uh, came to exist. Yeah. yeah mm -hmm. um, we had, uh, we had uh, one of us, uh, Mr. Hamad, uh, you see it uh, on uh, the second person from uh, my right hand, uh, who happened mm -hmm. to participate during a, 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 a World Economic Forum in Davos 2019. Then he presented a view uh, to the panel, that, uh, and then it was like a discussion that uh, the goods, the money, capital are moving uh, freely across the world. Then uh, he, he posed a question, Mr. Mohamed, how, how is it that uh, we have about uh, 185 uh, refugees uh, stuck in the camp and yet uh, they live for uh, about uh, 20 years and uh, they can't have a marketable skills that can connect them to global opportunities. So uh, when uh, they meet, the, uh, during the meeting, uh, we had uh, an opportunity of one of uh, the participant, uh, who is Mr. Anis, was very much touched, inspired, and the thought of uh, coming up with a, with a skill that will connect uh, the refugees to uh, putting to globally. So, um, and then uh, it, uh, it came, the idea was, was uh, presented to Kakuma Refugee Camp, where uh, these leaders were. <coughs> Were seen, and the idea was presented to them about the scaling refugees and the opportunities that may give them some pay. And then um, uh, together, the UNHCR plus uh, uh, Mr. Anis, they agreed uh, to scale refugees on a social media marketing. Mm -hmm. And um, a step by step plan was designed, uh, to, uh, and then uh, the uh, a pilot group, who, uh, a pilot team was uh, uh, like um, selected, and then they were trained. Uh, uh, to uh, they were trained on uh, uh, the following social media platforms: Google, uh, Google My Business, Facebook for social media, Instagram, LinkedIn, and Twitter. And uh, like enough, uh, Mr. Anis went further and then communicated with. Uh, the the owner of this uh, software, uh, the wood suit, and Canva, uh, who gave him a uh, uh, free access to this, uh, and then the refugees were taken through the same, and then uh, uh, they were capable of executing the jobs. So 
majorly uh, water uh, came in uh, in uh, what really brought a lot of meaning was uh, uh, like uh, earlier state that uh, was to train them on social media marketing and social media selling where by social media uh, social media selling it is a uh, one one to one uh, uh, so it is a uh, more individual conversations where uh, uh, you send a message to somebody and then you see like the same way that you, uh, you saw my message yeah? that's how we execute a social media selling the seven steps huh? uh, we first understand the client's objective in the context we frame the, the objective of the, of the client in a very powerful story and then the same uh, story is converted into a, into a video and then later we identify the target audience huh, of the client. Uh, I will show you uh, if we have, a, we still have some time, I will show you how we identify the, the audience huh, of, our, of our clients. And then later we convert the video uh, and then we, we, we frame a first message and then a second message. Which is the same way that you received my message. Yeah? I think you were able to see my first message that was touched together with a, with the invitation, uh, this is the same way that we do for our clients. And then uh, mm -hmm. uh, the first message is sent after the first message center, the, the way you did, uh, and then you connect after connecting, and then I send you a second message. And then uh, a meeting, I uh, wanna, uh, they find it interesting with uh, what we do, like you, you did yourself, and then uh, uh, they give us a, a, a way to present the, the way that we are we are doing now. And then. Uh, we converse with the with the connected audience. Uh, the way we co we converse, and then you ask me like maybe we can set up a meeting, and then uh, uh, we formalize a meeting for our clients. So this is happened the same thing that we we did with you. So this is the social media selling, and the more, uh, a, a good number of our clients that we are serving because now we have about a fifth, a fifth line clients that we are serving, and they prefer more. Uh, social media selling rather than uh, social media marketing. And then uh, social media marketing, uh, we do the following. This is now uh, where uh, we take, we, we, we manage the account, the Facebook account, the Twitter account, the LinkedIn account, uh, the Instagram, and then uh, we post a article, a link, a, link, uh, a poster, an image, so to, uh, to a target audience. So this is what happens huh, with the social media marketing. And then uh, we we started with lining the, the clients. We, uh, we determined the influencers, uh, the people that I talk much about, uh, uh, about uh, the objective uh, of our clients. And then we connect uh, uh, with the relevant uh, using the poster. Then uh, uh, we, we create uh, some, some way that the people can like and share our, our poster, the comment, the tag, mm -hmm. and then a pointer. Uh, point of view videos we also do the same but uh, like uh, what i mentioned earlier that uh, uh, most of our clients they like most uh, they like uh, social media selling rather than uh, social media marketing and uh, social media uh, selling it is a uh, uh, it happens uh, to be very much influential because uh, you speak with somebody so it is like sending somebody an, an, an sms or sending somebody a, 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 a an individual email. So he doesn't have to escape reading it for 90%. So most of them, it has, it has run very uh, successfully. Indeed. And then um, uh, I might uh, want to share with you, if uh, we still have like in a, a few minutes, uh, to share with you how we, we, we may identify the target audience. Uh, uh, for you, when uh, do you prefer to have a uh, uh, social media marketing executed for your company? Uh, so you, you'll uh, uh, bear with me a, a little bit here. Let me try to share. Um, Mr. Kiza, sorry, can you hear me? Yes, I can. can. Yes. Um, uh, yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. Uh, so far as you are trying to share with me how you normally probably get your target audiences, I have uh, like one question on what you have said. Like, I feel like there are two main points, uh, you know, presenting everything that you guys are doing, the social media selling and social media marketing. 
Like in one yes, yes, word or one sentence, can you be able to give me a difference between the two so that I can be able to know which one can fit my company? As you know, very well, you can see um, the CEO of uh, a company based in Nigeria. We normally do like, it's, it's a company that uh, targets tourists coming, you know, in Nigeria and uh, we give them good time. And uh, I would like to know, which one to go for, either selling or, or, you know, social media marketing and why, you know. So I would like to get a clear picture between the two. Thank you. Yeah, all right. Um, thank you for the question. Like uh, I mentioned, uh, that uh, on social media selling, what we do mostly, it is, um, so we manage one account, uh, particularly uh, we work on a LinkedIn. Uh, so we, we will take your... Uh, your LinkedIn account, then uh, uh, we generate, uh, we generate, uh, we generate a uh, target audience for you. And then we mm -hmm. start sending uh, an indeed, yeah, so a one-to-one -one message to those, uh, uh, to those audience. So with mm -hmm. the social media marketing, it is a uh, uh, you send a post, uh, and then uh, we there are some, mm -hmm. some some people that we tag into the post that uh, in going mm -hmm. through their 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 Facebook, their Twitter, their Instagram, their LinkedIn. Uh, they will go. They, they might have a, a glance at your uh, at your post. But Maybe, uh, social media uh, selling is much. Sorry, the DVD of it is a message one to one. Yeah. Sorry, Mr. Kisha. Can you show us? You know, um, can you show us in the, in the screen how uh, you know you will do both? You know, let's say social media selling for tourist or red, let's say you are the tourist company in Nigeria. Can you open your LinkedIn and show us? Uh, how will you, uh, you know, uh, you know, select your target audience? Because then maybe my CEO Joel, she will know how exactly you know you are doing. Because it's very, very difficult to listen to words. M maybe it's very easier to see, you know, pictures, and we can all understand what is the difference between selling and marketing. Okay. Yeah. Sure, Mr. Uh, uh, that will be helpful. Yeah. Uh, you will allow me to share. Yes. Yeah. 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 So while uh, Keisha is opening, I think uh, the company Joel talked about is very interesting, right? So you are a tourist company in uh, Nigeria and uh, you want to attract all the people, um, you know, either inside Nigeria or outside in Africa or outside across the world. You want to um you know bring them and show them some really good stuff like adventure uh, adventure tourism in nigeria or uh, or uh, you know road trip in nigeria or something like that let's say you have three big you know tourism products in nigeria and you want to basically market those ideas and you also want to sell those ideas but the question joel has is what is the right thing to do to market it or to sell it Yes, Kisha. You're, you're able to share your screen, yes. Kisha? Yes. Yes. Um, but if we start with um, uh, social media selling, uh, okay. this is what we, we, we get our, uh, our target audience uh, on a sales meeting. So, You know, with me. Sure. I think. Um, mm. yes, Joel, so I'm the social media. Uh, so uh, to do this, uh, we we, we target yeah. uh, to get our target audience. Uh, we go uh, we go with a, a geographical area, like you said, that we're in Nigeria, and um, you might want people from uh, I don't know. Uh, from UK, from US, from Canada, from uh, Egypt, from South Africa. So we target them using uh, their, ge their geographical uh, regions, where, where the, in the country they are in, even the state they are in. All this is provided by the, 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 the sales and data in LinkedIn. So when we come to geographical here, uh, so we, 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 uh, uh, we, we try to look at uh, which 
which area can we can we target? That, for instance, mm -hmm. here uh, we can target uh, perhaps U.S. United like States. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. So in the United States, uh, we have uh, 174 million people on the LinkedIn. Mm -hmm. Yes. And then, uh, uh, since uh, we are, uh, you said that uh, uh, you are, you, uh, you, 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 you are, you are, you are company. Uh, uh, the, your company jobs it is a uh, it welcome the, the the tourists you mean yeah so actually that's our then, main target like we target tourists who come in nigeria like in africa basically in nigeria and we can give them like a tour around nigeria and uh, at least give them good time in nigeria and uh, facilitate them integrating whatever they want including papers as well if they want so we also do that for our clients so in this case, in this scenario, we might, uh, uh, I think that it is not a, so we, uh, we, uh, when we are trying to get the, the, the target audience, mm -hmm. we go uh, by the company, the industry, the seniority, the function and the title of uh, the people that we are targeting. But in this case, I'm mm -hmm. trying to look at uh, how we can go with the seniority, maybe, uh, you, you, we might target um, uh, the CEOs, the managers, maybe when they are, they are on their recreation, they can take a time to come to Nigeria and then have a, uh, have a recreational time and uh, to move around and then see what is happening with uh, uh, what is there within, uh, within your, your company. So, so we can look at uh, the, seniority, the seniority level and then, um, yeah, we, uh, we, we might take the directors the manager just mm -hmm. stop people, the people that uh, when they have they, they are on a recreation, they, they can come around and, uh, and see uh, the, the, the beauty of Nigeria. <laughs> so here we... Okay, Kisha, your time is up. <laughs> yeah. uh, this is amazing, Kisha. You know, very, uh, this is uh, really a good job. Amazing job. Thank you, Kisha. Uh, Joel, you also played a fantastic, fantastic role play. Fantastic. I really liked it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Joel already. I miss. I, I want to so ask like one so important question. Actually, yeah, yeah. As yeah. probably we'll try with another person since we have four of them, so we don't yeah. have to put everything on Kiza because I, I can feel <laughs> the pressure. He's sweating right now. He's sweating. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So we can we can just ask that question to another person, I guess probably. Yeah. No, yeah. no, but uh, but is there any uh, feedback? You know, I think it's important to uh, you know give feedback to Kisha, uh, so that the next person, or the next person, or the next person, you know, keeps correcting the problems that we saw in Kisha's presentation. Uh, can mm -hmm. you guys, you know, uh, do, please don't tell it was great, good, you know, yeah, that's good, yeah. But uh, what, 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 what what are the various things that he needs to improve? You know, can we start with, um, you know, maybe one by one, Ahmed, you know, Joel, you can start if you want, Jean-Marie, Bahana, you know, I want at least one point from everybody, you know, what is that Tisha can improve? I think one, from what I can say, is time management. Since mm -hmm. I, I can feel like there, there's still more to talk about to convince the client, but because of the time. Imagine if it was just okay, so 10 Joel, minutes. Yeah, that's good. That's yeah. good. Okay, time time management is good. Just keep it short, your feedback. But yeah. Joel, what was the problem with time management? What was he doing wrong? He was repeating why, why, himself. Why? Yes, he was repeating yeah. himself, right? And why was he repeating himself? Why was he repeating uh, himself? I think because uh, maybe, I don't know if he had good time to go through his presentation before <laughs> presenting. So, you know, you are just playing around and see the next slide, the next slide, how it go, for, you know. Yes. Next. So, okay. yeah, repeat, okay. repeat you know, himself. Yeah. You, know, yeah, you know why he was repeating himself? Because he has not prepared a speech. That's what I think. Every yeah. slide, he has to speak three sentences. 
he has to speak three sentences for every slide he has not mm-hmm. written down his three sentences if he has written his three sentences he will open the slide be very calm and say hi joel my name is keisha i'm a refugee graduate from kakuma refugee camp at step up dot one we believe education and opportunity should be given to every single one of us and therefore you know uh, we started step up 2 years ago it should be like you know precise no yes. blah 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 you know because yeah. you can do blah 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 because you you are talking from your brain you know in a mm-hmm. in a typical in a typical presentation to a client where you have only 5 minutes to pitch never talk from your brain just mm-hmm. do a prepared speech it's better mm. because in a prepared speech you will never miss any point out right and you will not be like rushing ah blah 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 you know you won't be like you know going fast but i i really you know what i really liked about keisha's thing is was the spirit of his presentation he really you know it was there's a lot of passion in his voice and i really you know, liked it okay so that is good so thanks i have written it down time management repetition and why that repetition because you know he did not know exactly the the point that he was going to make in every slide you know that's one okay any uh, next zamzam ali kasi what, what does your feedback to you know um you know to kisha uh, you want you need, you need to be really quick huh? tak 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 that's it come on guys every anybody yasmin yeah. shem yeah. yeah hello oh let me go first Yes. Uh, yes. Yes, Shamari. Go, go ahead. Okay. So for me, I can uh, say that that was a wonderful speech because it is the the first trial. You know, mm-hmm. it's not that easy always. But mm-hmm. uh, as you have mentioned, uh, we need just to, you know, already the client. You know about the client. Mm-hmm. You be careful when you first introduce when you are welcoming them and uh, what you do. then you go straight to the point yes okay to, okay to so jamari we yeah, yeah quick quick you, you have to be really quick with your feedback so you, so he has to introduce himself properly first is that what you're saying okay. i think the the introduction was not uh, okay okay very good so he has to say my name is jamari i'm a refugee graduate from the kokuma refugee camp I have been with Step Up. We started Step Up two years ago. I have been with Step Up almost the last, you know, twelve months. You know, something like that. You know, introduction. Yeah. Is, is that right, Shamari? The Shamari? first introduction. Mm-hmm. The client in the introduction, even the client can be able to understand what what is all about. Okay. Just okay. The, the first introduction. Okay. One one more thing. Uh, should we ask the client also to introduce uh, Shamari? because you know i don't think uh, um, keisha asked the client uh, no. because uh, maybe he can ask the client before to go to slide presentation he can mm-hmm. ask the client if there is any question he has, he or she has before they go through Mm, yeah no questions okay questions are okay okay but because we were we are doing, but uh-huh. we must ask so first we introduce then we must ask the client please can you go ahead and introduce yourself that's the like a basic courtesy okay so first introduce your, yourself then give time to the client so that they can introduce so that yes thank you jamri kasi can can people actually raise yeah. their hands you know when they have a question please you know uh, on the feedback no i want everybody zamzam yasmin shem all of you should give you know feedback yes quick quickly yeah. Yes my my the, the thing that I came to I did notice on my side is that uh, we were not in the conversation it's like we were not able to identify the right tag get out uh, we don't know are they directors CEOs what we did not we finalized the the, the conversation no. but we did not yeah. identify the yeah. right target audience correct, to correct, me correct. Yes. Yeah. no kashi yeah. that's a very important point i actually stopped him he was trying to do it but uh, i think you know too much time so yeah that's right you know he was not able to do the right target audience and i i think you know uh, kafi um, what we should try to do 
is uh, you know not um, i think we should not try to you know like for example i'm thinking like this right you know we should not try to uh, you know uh, unless we have a really top notch internet connection we should not try to go here i think you know we should instead capture everything you know here itself um sorry you know in the in the picture itself somewhere um so that um, you know uh, we don't need to um, you know we don't need to go to the thing so uh, what i mean is we have to do screenshot you understand you know let's do a screenshot of how we will do this so that we don't need to go and you know internet speed ex- everything you know is a problem so uh, i would rather keep everything in a screenshot rather than you know um, uh, rather than doing a real demo a real demo is going to be you know time consuming yes uh, yes uh, zack zack and yasmin yeah uh, zack you can go first oh hi uh, actually it is absolutely an amazing thing. Uh, but you know, a very few of the people, like one two percent, uh, they was fine, fine. Like they was doing like uh, poor alias in Paris, no way by. Uh, the presenter was trying to do the presentation, and he was at the same time thinking about you know what would you know what the statement follow. There was some time in between what he has to say now and what he was planning. Like it was leaving the client sometimes to feel boring about like, what is wrong with the with the presentation of the presentation. Zach, uh, your uh, your uh, voice was not able to understand. Is it okay if you type your uh, feedback, Zach? You know, I found it very difficult to understand. Uh, I could hear it, but it was very difficult for me to understand. If you don't mind, can you type your uh, thing? Yes, Yasmin. Uh, hello, Anis. Yes. Yes, yes, Yasmin. Um, Go ahead. Yeah, actually, I was. I think when he was uh, explaining between social. media selling and social media marketing he was not uh, well clear that i think he should know the difference between them yes yes he didn't he never yeah yeah yasmin fantastic thank you uh, everybody is going to ask what is the difference between marketing and sales especially especially after seeing the price difference <laughs> right you know you are going to show them it's 100 dollars to um, you know do this and 200 dollars to do that right especially in this slide uh, they are going to stop you and they are going to ask you you know what the why is it so expensive right uh, you should be able to show the difference uh, in you know really quickly you know i think that is re- really important uh, everybody so uh, yeah agreed uh, and and i'm thinking uh, yasmin that uh, especially in this slide right you know they will say whoa why is one is 100 dollars other is 200 dollars what what are you guys doing differently so you have to explain this properly right social media marketing is creating one post right and just putting it on your uh, channel you know putting it on your facebook you know you guys do that every day you create a post and put it on your facebook that's what is marketing you would have never done social media selling never in your life because that's not what you do this is what you do every day in your life marketing you know you keep liking somebody you keep tagging somebody you keep uh, uh, retweeting something you keep reposting something you share that's what you've been doing that's called social media marketing selling is you are talking to somebody in a email in an email like fashion one to one conversation right um so it's it's really important you know so what i think uh, i think we should do is have a slide uh, where you know we capture the screen something like this kesha maybe we can capture the slide like this you know so we can say this is social media marketing and this is social media selling you understand what i'm saying kesha so then it becomes very clear ah now i get it okay so if you talk to eric johnny jonathan one after the other then it is social media selling but if you simply go and post it on linkedin then it is social media marketing right so we can create a slide like this to explain the difference between social media marketing and social media selling yeah fair enough okay next uh, yeah, yeah, thank yeah, you yeah sure sure yeah yeah yasmin very very good uh, point okay yeah thank you what else who else is there anybody else wants to give feedback okay while we are waiting for other people to give feedback to kisha really quickly kisha 
uh, you did not press your presentation button you know i was able to see everything on the left and also everything on the right you know you are not on full screen mode i noticed that right uh, the that was i don't know whether you realize it never do a presentation on a slide deck so you know you know how it was uh, it was like this i'm sure i'm sure everybody saw it it was like this correct and it was not even like this there was something open here also like uh, i don't know what to say but uh, there was uh, like let's say you know yeah even this side was open like this correct i don't know whether people saw it so kisha was you know presenting it like this right she was presenting it like this you should always press the presentation button kisha you should present it like this full screen is that is that clear kisha sunny sam getting it yeah cool okay next uh, one more thing uh, kisha uh, i i am assuming you did not write down your speech kisha is that true uh, is that right or you wrote it down somewhere but you know it's it's uh, you know you just read it too fast yes sir i i i had it on my on you my uh, screen yeah diary so on your diary okay. i was referring myself okay. to the diary yeah. Yeah. Okay 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 so i want everybody to see and tell me whether they can see the screen actually okay um when i show you the screen what do you see um let me see um okay can you see the screen everybody we have to see yeah do you see yes, do you can see, see it do you see this yeah do you see the script hi my name is bahana i am a step up one do you see that also yeah okay okay so you have to be really careful you know uh, this is what i call the presenter mode you know this is something that is there in slide so um we you, we need to learn how to do this when you do this um ideally uh, your uh, client who is presenting who's seeing it should not be able to see the script okay so if you look at this i can read this script hi my name is bahana i am a step up on refugee graduate from refugee care, kakuma we started step up dot one nearly 2 years ago so you see i'm actually reading this one okay but when you see it from your side you should not be able to see this the fact that i'm reading it okay we'll find out how to do it you know maybe sometime later but this is how it should be you should not write it down on your diary you should not write it anywhere it should be right there in front of your eyes so that when you when you are uh, presenting it to the client it's there right in front of you okay so we will figure this out how to do it huh? Okay, let me come back. All right, who's going next? Shem, are you ready? Yes. Well, do you do you want to be the client or anybody else want to be the client now? <laughs> I, I I still I don't have any problem if anyone <laughs> wants to be a client, or I can just do it. So I don't have any problem. Okay. all right okay uh, shem you know uh, joel is your client again so you know let's see what you can do okay shem you can start presenting uh, your slides and then you know you can start talking can you see it uh not yet shem not yet it's uh, it's file sharing not file uh, device oh sorry maybe it's because i'm sharing it that's why yeah can you do it again shem please sorry maybe i was sharing it and that's why it was not allowing you to share yeah yeah now i think we are getting something oh no no it went away Uh, can somebody you know i was zak was commenting about something i really wanted to see ahmed it was fantastic and superb but time consuming due to over speed and uh, known person i can say yeah that is good zak was saying communication skills so ah, yes. can you see when the meeting cool uh-huh. yeah 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 uh, we can see you we can see uh, your screen uh, sham yeah okay mm-hmm. Uh yeah my, my name is uh, Shem John um Joel 
Okay. I know, um, yes, uh, I don't know what's your name. Uh, uh, can you uh, please uh, uh, introduce yourself uh, once more? Sorry, Alice, I was laughing. I think, Shem, you have to show this first of all yourself. <laughs> <laughs> no, I couldn't hold okay. it. That's okay. I'm sorry. Let us. We are still at the beginning, Chef. Okay. Yeah, that's <laughs> okay. You, you can start again. You can start again, guys. Come on. Very good. Very good. I really like uh, how the way Shem started. Yes, yeah, Shem. Another time. Yeah. Um. Uh, my name is uh, Shem John. Mm -hmm. Um. Uh. Please, uh, Joel, can you uh? uh come up again and i you know once more introduce yourself uh, please if you don't mind uh hi shem uh thank you so much uh, my name is joel i'm based in the uk as you saw on my linkedin profile and uh, i'm a ceo of a company for beverage uh especially for adults so we we produce wine in the UK, and uh, I'm so pleased to meet you today after, you know, back and forth uh, messages on LinkedIn. It's a pleasure, and I'm looking forward to hearing more from you. Thank you. Yeah, uh, thank you. Uh, it's, uh, th thanks so much for uh, having me. Um, mm -hmm. Yes, um, I'll be, you know, a, li a little bit uh, uh, brief, uh, you know, um, at, at, you know, at step up. Uh, what we give and um you know what is all about our step up yeah you know and what we do actually yeah at step up we give our refugees uh graduates uh skill uh and a care pride and true independence uh for uh for their better tomorrow if i can um you know um our mission, uh, step up with mission is, you know, to empower people in the refugee camp, you know, by teaching uh, them valuable skills and connecting them to opportunities uh, that pays. Uh, can mm -hmm. you hear me, Joel? Sure, sure. I can hear you. Go ahead, please. Yeah. So I'm going to give you a quick uh, introduction to step up, mm -hmm. uh, how it started, and then. Uh, or maybe later uh, you may have a question so we can sure. we can uh, we can uh, answer your questions uh. mm -hmm. what? Mo uh, Mohammed uh, is a refugee co-chair uh, co 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 at a world economic forum in a uh, attend who attended uh, a world economic forum in a, you know two years ago and mm -hmm. uh, he actually inspired, you know, uh, step up. Uh, that's one. I mean, inspired, you know, uh, Mohammed, uh, who is the, the founder uh, of Step Up, on, uh, in order to rescue refugees in the camps and uh, find or connect them to opportunities uh, that pays. And eventually, um, or decided to rescue them in a in a social social media or marketing. Mm -hmm. and, uh, thankfully, um, we pitched the idea of rescuing refugees and uh, find them opportunity that can pay. And gratefully, we thank God that uh, our proposal was accepted by the UNHCR. And then together, we actually decided to rescue refugees on uh, social media uh, marketing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, step up. We, oh no, we started uh, with. Uh, sorry, this. Shem. Yes. Sorry, Shem. One quick interruption. You are doing the same mistake that Kisha is doing, so that's why I'm interrupting. You need to, you know, when I when you share your screen, I'm actually able to see everything. I'm able to see your, uh, you know, note notes. I'm able to see this. Always go on presentation mode. So so, uh, you know, click on the presentation mode, which is down here, and then you can go to presenter notes. You know, you know this. Uh, yeah, if you there is the yeah, yeah. That's that next one, next one, next one, next one, next. Yes, that's yeah. it. That's okay. Yeah, if you click that, okay. okay. Now, now you can't see them. You know, now you you can't see your notes, right, Kish, uh, Shem? You you know your notes. Your notes is also gone, correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. If you right click, can you right click? Right click using your mouse. Uh, no, right click, yeah, and then show presenter view. 
yeah show presenter view no not that uh, that's the one yeah 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. okay now you can now you can read it can you see can yes. have you yeah, yes yes go ahead now you can go ahead yeah yeah uh i was somewhere here mm-hmm. yeah so i mean uh uh so we, we can proceed so uh step up or started with uh, you know five refugees uh, as uh, as a uh, as you know as our pilots uh, as their pilot team and uh thanks be uh we currently are 50 our uh, strong uh, team and we are looking forward to become 500 by 2022 and uh as you can see, uh, we have the five, uh, you know, refugees uh, who stepped up in social media marketing from uh, the Kakuma refugee camp. Okay. Yeah. So uh, we were able to uh, select these five tools so that we can give our services, our social media marketing and social media our selling, uh, you know, to our, our standard, uh, to our profession standards. And uh, we we we, all, we trained them. Uh, we trained our five pilot team to use uh, this as the right platform to deliver the right impact for every individual uh, client. And uh, our services uh, is based on uh, these two, uh, you know, our keys: um, social media marketing and uh, social media you know, sailing. Uh, as you know, social media, uh, social media sailing uh, is, uh, you know, one-to-one conversation. And uh, for social media marketing, it's, you know, creating one, you know, channel uh, to be, to be, you know, brief. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so we have our, you know, our evidence, uh, you know, based on a, you know, step-by-step approach on, you know, how to generating, to generating a pipeline. Uh, we are from step one up to seven, uh, as you can see. Understanding uh, clients' is objective, uh, converting them to storyline, and uh, turning them to our visual stories, and then identifying target audience connecting with a you know target audience and conversation with connected audience for formalizing conversation i mean uh, from step 1 to now to step uh, step 7 uh, this is exactly uh, how our approach to generating you know pipeline first of all we need to understand we need to understand our client's objective and uh, secondly uh, we have to convert them to a, a storylines you know mm-hmm come up with it. Uh, and then uh, thirdly uh, turning them to a visual a visual story and uh, also uh, fourth we also have to identify uh, the targets I mean uh, the audience that we are targeting and now also then uh, uh, five connecting with uh, you know a target audience I mean those are the the, the steps uh, mm-hmm. Yeah, and um, for for social media uh, marketing, uh, delivers also one-to-one communication and scale while uh, building a relevant target uh, audience. You know that's uh, uh, from one up to uh, one up to six, where number one is you know our baseline uh, declines, uh, determine influencers, influencers. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no, I think no, Shem. This is good, Shem. You know, your time is up. Uh, so, Joel and everybody else, can you ask questions to Shem? So, Shem is still Shem is still presenting. He is not yet done. This is not feedback. Uh, you can play the client like Joel and ask uh, Shem questions. Yeah, Joel. You know, you go first. Um. Thank you so much, Shem. So far, um, so good. I just have one question since I. You have an idea on uh, my company, what we, we do. I, I guess maybe you went through our profile. But uh, I wanted to highlight with you that we have a selling team, uh, like agent around around the world. 
who facilitate us on you know sales of our products and also a marketing team based in the UK. But uh, we were eager to you know find out how well you can present you know your 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 package and your work so that we can see where you guys can fit with our team because we we really want we really want uh, to focus on social media we don't like most of the time we don't focus on that because we have so many you know people big companies we deal with as partners so we don't have really time to have one on one with our clients or our consumers let, let me say that so how are you going to you know to present either on selling and marketing so that we can also be in touch with, with the consumers directly than the way we normally we work with agents and uh, and uh, partners uh, you know for for quite long we have been working in that way thank you yeah thank you so much for your question uh joel um Okay, this is how we can help you uh, mm -hmm. for our team. Um, oh, first of all, okay, uh, on, on your, I mean, uh, basing on how we can help you, we are going to, you know, mostly, uh, you know, use our social media, you know, marketing, which is, uh, which delivers one-to-one -one communication and uh, a scale while building a relevant target audience by reaching out to, you know the buyers uh mm -hmm. or, you know of your company okay i don't know if uh my question i mean my answer is uh, no i wanted to answer on selling and marketing as well since we have the team for that but uh we wanted to focus on social media as you guys are focusing on social media both on selling and, and marketing Okay. So I wanted to know how are you going to help us and help our team, especially to be in touch and have the, that one-on-one -on -one with our, you know, um, consumers. I mean, our end users. Oh, okay. Uh, therefore, so we, we we then we are supposed to uh, to base on. Uh, I mean, uh, first of all, what you're supposed to do is. Uh, to we need to uh, you know identify your target first of all the, the, you mean your, your targets I mean uh, the people that you want uh, that, that you want them to come to your company to come and you know buy some stuff from your company so we focus on those uh, our people we target them mm -hmm. you know, by uh, you know uh, <clears throat> Shem, yes. let me help you. Shem, let me help you. So yeah. when a client asks a question, you know, the best way to answer the question, if you don't know the answer, okay, if you know the answer, just say them, you know, straight away. Yeah, the yeah. best way to answer a client's question that you don't know is to ask another question back to them. Okay. Right? Mm -hmm. So if, if Joel says some blah, 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 and you don't understand what is she saying, See, you can ask some really simple question, you know. So, uh, so, so, Joel, are you a B two B Are you a B two B company or a B two C company? No, B two B company. Okay. If you are a B two B company, you really don't need social media marketing. You know, marketing is mainly for B two C. Okay. If you are selling, if you are selling to businesses, like you said, business mm -hmm. to business, B two B. Yes. Then yeah. what you need, Joel, is one-to-one -one selling based on social media. So we recommend that you pick up our social media selling service uh, for mm -hmm. $200 a month where mm -hmm. I or one of my team can represent mm -hmm. you or one of your team in order mm -hmm. to sell to your target businesses. That is the best thing we can do. Okay. So, okay, so, 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 yeah, thanks, Joel. Okay, so let's stop it right now because, you know, I don't want, I want other people also to answer. But let's hear, Ahmed, you know, Joel company needs one-to-one. -one. Please may you evaluate more on, yeah, uh, okay. Yes, tell her more about one-to-one. -one. Yeah, she said one-to-one -one many times. So we should have picked up on that one-to-one -one and then said, you know, Joel, only you need this. You don't need marketing. Yes, we can also do marketing for you, but that is not very effective. 
you know mm-hmm. okay in any any other questions kasi uh, yasmin you know any other questions to shem something that comes to your mind guys anybody any questions um okay i think it's the same kind of uh, thing you know going on full screen the speech was okay the good thing about shem was he had prepared a speech if you see shem can you show them um, you know can you can you go away from your you know presenter just click end end presentation you know end the presentation so that you know i can see your notes uh you can just you know escape yeah yeah if you go yeah if you go up, look at this guys can you look here can you look at the bottom mohammed rafiji mm-hmm. co-chair you know this is what i call notes okay so when you are when shem was going from one st- one a slide to the next slide to the next slide he was not like you know running like a 100 meter race you know he was very quiet and very cool and he says you know we pitch the idea of reskilling refugees and finding them opportunities you know gratefully our proposal was accepted by the unhcr team and then together we decided to the, the only problem with this point <laughs> is this point and the point on the slide are almost exactly the same <laughs> you see so we should not have it like that you know uh, we should try to make a point that is slightly more than that so uh, that's that's the only problem otherwise shem has done the preparation very well right uh, he had prepared his notes okay that's what was missing with kisha kisha had also prepared but he had prepared it on his diary but shem has prepared it on his you know powerpoint okay um he he uh, shem uh, can somebody tell me how was shem's introduction shem shem introduced himself and asked the, asked joel also to introduce come on bahana isra why are you guys being quiet you have to be you have to be brutal with your critique if you are if you are not brutal then your clients will be brutal with your colleagues yes jason yeah john uh, uh congratulations john for your presentation it was good i'm just talking about the on uh, the, pres- the the introduction uh, parts uh-huh. where you were introducing yourself and also asking your clients to introduce also but uh, i guess uh, that was cool but i guess in this case you already know the client because maybe she sent you or he sent you an email you've interacted during the messages so she's well known to you and uh, we let's save the time and not uh, asking uh, the same uh, uh, question uh, during the the, the the pitch because we we use that time for the pitch no i agree but also oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, sorry jason when, and uh, yes. the unit are presenting the pitch at the unit and uh, you know remember at this level all of us are graduates and we are speaking on behalf of uh, uh this step up but now it, they, during the presentation if we look like uh anis <laughs> uh don't think uh, the, the clients uh, will be a little bit confused and uh, will fail to understand that who who is who here we need to understand uh, that we are we are gra- uh, refugees uh, graduates yes Oh wow very good point Jason it's a fantastic point in fact uh, Keisha also told me about that point uh, you you have to be, you have to call yourself i am one of the group leaders i am one of the step up dot one group leader uh, you know who graduated from this program you know 6 months ago 1 year ago 2 years ago something like that so you know it's easy for everybody to understand so that is uh, right there in your first Two minutes, okay. Let me, uh, Jason. Uh, I I think I got your point, but I want to tell. I don't know whether to call you John because your brother, you know, called you John. So I'm also going to call you John. So 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 John, um, you know, um, your introduction has to be a little bit more than hi. My name is Shem. I, you know, uh, Joel. Can you now introduce yourself? You know, that that's not nice. You know, you're you you know, it sounds very rude actually. You just told your name. you told your name and you ask your client to you know start introduce so 
what you should say is you know hi uh, joel my name is john i'm one of the uh, leaders uh, uh, you know from the kokuma refugee camp um i uh, sorry i'm i'm one of the group leaders at the step up one dot uh, program um i am uh, you know been around in this program for the last 6 months or one year uh you know uh, i have a i have a team of you know 10 people uh, with me and we are delivering you know the step up dot one uh, uh, reskilling as well as you know working for a client for a lot of time something like that you know some basic introduction you know and then say uh, yeah over to you just simple o- 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 over to you joel for your interaction or uh, introduction simple just you know okay joel uh, you know uh, we already know a lot about you so jason you should always tell the, your client to introduce again so even though you know them everything you should always give your client a, a minute or two okay so you say uh, joel you know i already know you but i still want to uh, you know uh, know more from you it would be great if you can introduce yourself that is a, uh, that is a must jason it does not consider time waste um, you have to make your client speak within the first 1 minute of your call your client has to speak the the call cannot be you know you talking all the time huh? you, your client has to speak within the first 1 minute otherwise i think uh, it was a great pitch i really like shem uh, john uh, speech it's quite nice it was very well prepared um, but it is giving me a lot of great ideas you know uh, i also need to prepare the speech um you know uh, by wearing your hat that is what jason is saying right uh, the speech uh, you know is almost like uh, me speaking rather than you know john speaking so i have to see how to prepare the slides and Uh, thing so that you know it feels like uh, john speaking and not me speaking okay that's pretty much it from my side anyone else mahana isra kasi any other feedback for shem uh okay no no, no feedback but uh, i just want to say that uh, i have uh, learned from a uh, feedback so next time and I, i think i should i should do the right thing and i should yes, not yes. act as a uh, am the uh, mohammed and is but uh, um you know uh, someone I, i'm shame john uh, you know so yes absolutely absolutely yeah fantastic good good yes sorry sorry and i uh, have a concern uh, like yeah. that just came back to my mind mm-hmm. uh, is really is it really important to for you know someone who is pitching to ask uh, the clients how if he or she is comfortable to be called by the name or mrs or mr or you know because um, i don't know if that is important no <laughs> not at all important no it's not okay. at all important just call them so if you see shem john just call them shem if you see ahmed mohammed ali just call them hi ahmed if you see kasi okay. bisima just say hi kasi don't even say mrs mr don't say mr mrs sir this madam. that nothing just okay. madam nothing no no, no just say kisha just, i was just no. thinking about it since Ki- when we started with kisha kisha was like hey madam joel you know and then for for she no. is like no. hey joel no. so i'm just no, trying no. to look at the two what what no. can we you know capture no. no mr no mr no mrs no madam nothing you know we are no, we are we are all same we are going to talk to them like you know hi kasi that's it thank you okay. joel for bringing that uh, i have also a concern on that uh, ani uh, like for example it's a title like a doctor or a professor ah uh, is it always mm. mentioned i think so no no i agree doctor and professor is a different thing right Do- you, if somebody says you know but you know it's okay you know uh, in, my wife is a doctor but um, she is okay you know if somebody calls her you know dr ashma that's fine if she does they call her you know just ashma that's also fine um but, but doctor and professor is 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 different okay if somebody is a doctor it's always better to call them you know dr ali or dr jamari or dr kasi right uh, it's a different thing or professor sham professor yasmin you know professor uh, patients that's a different thing but don't say mr mrs madam it's not required not in my world yes kasi um yes uh, on the on shams uh, pitching is that uh, 
what I came to, what I noticed is that uh, he did a very good presentation, and uh, I really liked the way he did it and the way he did prepare. Uh, but to my opinion, and I feel like uh, it's good we also consider the time of the, 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 the client that we are going to have a meeting with, because we might have much time discussing about, uh, like presenting what we, the, sto the history, all these stuff, and then we don't get a time to tell them what, we, what is our intention and uh, what directly we want to do with them and what made us to be with them on that specific very day. Very good, very good, very good. Kasi, yes. excellent point. You know, I'll repeat this point Kasi made. This is a million dollar point Kasi made. Uh, why are we telling the story of Step Up? Right? Why are we telling the story, history, geography, philosophy of Step Up? Why don't we come to the point? At stepup.1, we do two things. Social media services, and social media marketing. Why don't we tell them just the two things and get started in life and get make some money? Why are we telling them the story, the story and history and who inspired us? Why that? Why should we tell all these things to people? Who's got an answer for that? Should we tell them the story? Yeah. Anis, yeah. uh, uh, Anis well, I yeah. think we should. Mm -hmm. well, my uh, can I yeah. can I okay. talk? Sorry. Yes, 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 yeah, please. Yeah, I, I think there is. It's very important, especially for us to tell to, to to tell our story, like where we are coming from, because we are looking yeah. at the impact. Because our main objective is not money, as we always say that it's not about making money. Of course, <laughs> there is profit behind <laughs> it, but it's all about changing yeah. life and uh, you know the rescaling. Uh, steps that we are putting and the impact that our projects has, especially for people who don't have opportunities, refugees. And then that's, that's the most important thing. Some clients but, can just sign you because you are a refugee. And because we have just shown, you know, kind of uh, maybe issue. resilience and, uh, you know, being positive and say, I can stand. So it's really important, uh, you know, for us to say our story. Yeah. That's my opinion. Point taken, point taken. Let's listen to Isra, uh, Isra, Bahana. You guys are saying something. Yeah. Ahmed and patient. Okay. I'll come to you. Uh, yes, thank Isra, you. From my, yeah. from my side, I can say uh, it's very important for us to tell the story of Step Up because yeah. uh, there are some clients who don't believe in the work of freelancers. They will mm -hmm. be like, okay, if I give you this work, how will I be assured that you will be able to do this? I'm a like you will just uh, escape maybe after I pay you, something like that. So <laughs> when you put the story, they will be like, okay, from the story, they can see the successful things that you have did. And then someone may be interested even in hiring you to do your their work with a- Amazing, company. amazing. Isra, that point was amazing point. It's such an important point. You know, there are two points, uh, yeah. you know, uh, uh, just one second, Kasi. Yeah? Uh, Joel said, you know, emotion, you know, uh, the story is the only thing that matters to human beings, you know, everything else is secondary. So when you tell a story, people can relate to that story, you know, there is an emotional connect, you know, there is an emotional connect. Isra got another point, which is credibility. I'll tell you, credibility is the second most important thing after emotion. They, how do, how do the clients start believing that you are not some kind of a, you know, scam people, you know, people who are out to, you know, scam them. It's really important that, you know, you show the credibility by telling them the story, the achievements, the scaling, all those good things, you know, never ever try to sell something. If you try to sell something, nobody wants to buy. <laughs> So yeah, it's right. It's a very, very important. Yeah, Bahana, uh, it's it's your your chance. Oh, uh, I think you spoken. What happened, Bahana? Isra stole your point. <laughs> You've actually summarized the way you know I was actually thinking. But there's one thing. Uh, I I just, uh, I think all the presentations were all good. Huh? But uh, mm -hmm. Anis, um, you know, I'm still confused uh, at uh, one point. Huh? So, because uh, I'm assuming 
the first meeting with the client. Maybe you can clarify, yeah? or benefit mm -hmm. of all of us in this call. This is the first meeting we are doing with the client. Yeah? After we yeah. send the first second and conversation yeah. that's happening in LinkedIn. Yeah, so, first meeting. I'm seeing that we are missing a point. So I'm not sure whether I'm correct, huh? of understanding the client. We are more of uh, telling our own story, pitching, but uh, we are not getting the time to listen to the client because, uh, you know, it's like uh, telling the client, this is what I have, this is the value that, because it's also important to listen to the client, give uh, a time to the client to also talk about the, the, what they do, because uh, we don't need to assume that we really understand everything from the client. It's also, you know, when the client tells you what exactly, what they are doing, from that, uh, that point, you can uh, even be able to get the angle, you know, you can be able to tell them how best you can help them based on uh, your strategy, based on what you've actually pitched to them. I think it's very important. But the client has to see from the examples we've been showing in the slides, in the pitch, uh, but then when you actually tell him, uh, based on what you've just said, I think you are a B2B company, you're a B2C, this is how we can help you on A, B, C, D, and all these things. But we are not giving the client to, like, based on what I've just realized in this speech, if this is going to be what you're going to do, if we limit the conversation from there, from here, then we have to tell everybody if there is, uh, you know, it's very important to give the clients an opportunity to also yeah. pitch, you know, they are, I mean, what they do so that you are able to understand. That's the only way you can come up with a storyline or, you know, uh, otherwise, you know, if it's just all about your pitch, yeah. uh, you know, I don't know. Bahana, Bahana, super point, very good point. Uh, but um, Bahana, um, we are not yet come to that point. Okay, so this is how I've divided, um, you know. So I have divided the uh, the the pitch meeting. That's why I'm only giving you know 10 minutes for this pitch. Okay, I have divided the pitch meeting into you know the first half and the second half. Okay, not exactly half, but two two parts. The first half is introduction, your story, your pitch. That's the first half. In that half, first half, your introduction, your client introduction, your story, and your pitch. Okay, that's the first half. The second half is the, the client um, objectives, client question and answer, showing and telling the client how we can help, and then sign up. That's the second part. So your 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 uh, points are absolutely valid, and we will we will practice. You know the second half of the client meeting. Uh, where you know we will uh, ask question to the client, get them understand more objectives, give them more time. We will show them you know all the stuff that we can do, everything you know back and forth. So yes, your points are absolutely valid. But right now we are only practicing introduction, pitching your story, pitching your services. Yeah. Uh, you want to say something, Kasi? Okay. Looks like Kasi is, you know, okay. Yes, Jamari, you wanted to say something? Yes, Alice. Yeah, no, sorry. Uh, the, point, the, point. Hmm. Yeah, the point you wanted, I wanted to say you have shared because I totally agree with what Bahana said. It's like you are doing uh, one part of the meeting. Yeah. Because it's all about fitting. It's us telling about step up. Then we didn't dig, go deep and understand about the client. Then we saw how we can help. I agree completely. Yeah. Okay. That's yes, pretty much. Something. Yes. Please. Yeah. Yes. I was trying to to ask uh, like uh, like scenario of today is that uh, we, we 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 haven't learned about uh, uh, the, the companies or the client objective uh, prior to the meeting, and then okay. um, yeah. Go ahead. And go then ahead, uh, it, it yeah it happens that uh, uh, I send the second message today, and then. Uh, it's the same same day the, the, the client respond that can we have the meeting in the next uh, next coming coming oh, minutes? No. So we no 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 maybe no no, no. no, no. Uh, oh, sorry I thought I don't think I understood your question. Yes, I'm trying uh, to bring a point where I'm trying to bring mm -hmm. a point where we might not have mm -hmm. gotten a time to go through with the clients. Is it okay in that scenario, perhaps, uh, uh, to take a uh, uh, and another company is like uh, the one that we've worked with, how we generate yes. the target audience. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. You can try to show other clients examples after example after example, you know, to uh, to let them, you know, understand uh, how to do it. Yes, absolutely, Kesha, absolutely. 
um, see, um, so so Bah to Bahana's point, right? I think you know, guys, the first meeting. Okay, so we are not running. You know, uh, we have one meeting, and so far, ninety nine percent of the first meeting, ninety nine percent of the first meeting, it has resulted in the win. It has resulted in clients signing up for the thing. Ninety nine percent. The second meeting is always there for. you know some clarification question how to do but in the first meeting itself we have won the heart and mind of the client in the first meeting in the first 10 minutes itself the client has decided he wants to work with you the first 10 minutes so that's why this first 10 20 minutes is so important so so bahana um this is what i call it you know like that emotional uh, selling right um they know who you are they know your story they know what service you are providing and they know that you are credible okay they know that you have to you know, that's the most important thing they know that you are nobody wants to get cheated yeah so the moment they know that your story is true and you are a credible they want to sign you up even before you trying to understand their objectives it's all it, that's all you know uh some you know you need to do it it's not like you can uh, you need to do it but they have already mentally they have decided in their mind that they are going to hire you in the first 10 15 minutes that's that's what i uh, feel you know i'm not I, i'm i won't be able to prove that to you but that's what i feel you know in 10 minutes the client has already made up their mind whether they want to work with you or not okay so we have two people pitch what about uh, isra isra you want to pitch next <laughs> Who, who wants to pitch? Who has to pitch next? Actually, it is supposed to be Muhammad who is supposed to pitch. There are four people who agreed to pitch today, right? Bahana, do you remember who are the four people? I am among the ladies. Sorry? I am among the the people. Oh, you are there. <laughs> okay, Shamari. Yeah. <laughs> okay, because I remember Bahana escaped out of this thing. He didn't speak a single word uh, because uh, you know he needs to run. Okay, so uh, okay, so uh, yeah, go ahead, Jamari. It's your turn, and uh, Joel is the client again. I think it's good. I I'm on video, so that uh, we can learn also to be in visual with the client. Yeah, Joel is he still my client also. Yeah, Joel is still your client. <laughs> and uh, and uh, and uh, uh, jamari uh, yes it's good to be on video it's amazing to be on video that's another good point that i want to always start with your video on you need to keep your video on just for 2 minutes yeah just for 2 minutes after that it's going to be anyway in a screen right yeah it's a good practice joan uh, it's a very good practice to start with your video on and and one more thing you know i know it is uh, stretching too much Uh, uh you know uh, jamari can you share your uh, you know background you know like uh, instead of your current background um can you do something like this like this like this like this just now i made it can you guys see me yeah, yeah. Okay. can you can you apply can you apply your background uh how, how can you step you, you say um, you know ap- apply background effect do you see there are three dots if you click on the three dots you know there is something called apply background effects can everybody try it please if you don't mind can everybody just see if they can apply I, the background effect i can see only show device setting show meeting details interpol screen e body and the uh, turn off incoming video ah uh, why is that you why don't you have apply background effect you know, you know we are not saying zoom No, this is not Zoom. Uh, I think he has his video has to be on first of all, and then from there he can apply no. now the effect. 
no video is not a problem his video is on shamari's video is on but he's not even having it in the menu what about bahana other people uh, do you guys see the um, let them apply you can you can just now look i can just apply another background color can you see that i have applied some background colors that is perfect you know look you can yeah and you know this is the best one i want everybody to get this one if you want yeah like this see just you know if you have a background like this can you can you see my background uh, shamari yeah i can see step up that one yeah this is uh, Ali, how do you do this one changing the background <laughs> isra is interested in anything technology isra you have to click on this three buttons you know there are three bull uh, i don't know how to show you let me just share my screen uh, can you see can you guys see my screen uh, okay. yeah. no you can't see my screen actually um, yeah, but the three dots they can see uh, the three dots you can see right the three dots no i can't show you i can't show you i if i share that three dots goes away there are three dots yeah. device Maybe setting you can shot and then shy in a you can shot uh yeah i think i can do a screenshot yeah print screen and uh, oh yeah it and uh, the three dots you click on and then uh change it is a change layout uh, from there you can choose from the gallery yes exactly choose the gallery yes exactly that is all Anyway, don't worry about it. Come on, uh, uh, Shem. Sorry, Jamari, uh, uh, start. Maybe the time starts now. Yeah, maybe because I'm running it from the browser. Maybe oh, from browser it won't work. Okay. It it won't work from the browser. You have to download that yeah, Microsoft yeah. Teams. Yeah. I'm using different device. Mine is having problem with the sound. Yeah. Okay, no no problems. Okay, go ahead. Hi, Joel. Hi, Hi Shamari. Ah, okay. uh, my, yeah, uh, my name is Shamari. My name is Shamari. I'm a step up one graduate from Kakuma Refugee Camp. We started yeah. step up one nearly two years ago. We're still in mm -hmm. the college refugees with the opportunity that failed. Mm -hmm. We believe having access to education and uh, access to opportunities is a really a fundamental human right. I would appreciate mm -hmm. for your engagement and the making mm -hmm. for this thing. Thank you. Would I know about yourself? Uh, thank you, Jean Marie. Thank you for this call. I'm so pleased as well uh, talking to you for quite long, but uh, now we can meet. Uh, my name is Joel. I'm based in the US. And uh, working for a company in their marketing team, and I was really uh, interested by your message as people who support, you know, social media marketing. And as we know, in the US, we we are targeting youth from 20 to 45 years old. Most of them use social media, so I was really keen to know more about your work. And uh, I'm so pleased. So briefly, for our company. We we are um, shoe company like sneakers company, and we are targeting young people, especially runners, people who do sports. So I guess probably social media will be a best uh, platform for us to to reach out to our clients. So I'm so pleased to meet you and looking forward to hear more about your your work and your organization. Thank you so much. Thank you, Joel. I'll take you through, but let me share my screen. Sure. Anis, can Just you go ahead? Sorry, Anis, can you give me access to the screen sharing? Hello, I'm not getting access to the screen sharing. Oh, is it okay? uh i don't know how to do it uh because shem shem did it kisha did it i never had to give them access 
maybe it is because of your um, i don't know uh, can i can i do it on behalf of you if you don't mind um, i can or or you have changed the presentation yeah so is it okay now can you see my screen i am only presenting so i don't know whose screen are you seeing ha ah, yeah yeah we are able to see your screen yes okay yes uh, go ahead go ahead uh, jamari we are able to see your screen yeah we are set up and we give our fpg graduate uh, the skill a career path and be independent it was a uh, 2019 when uh, one of us uh, mohammed was uh, in a world economic forum uh, was inspired by uh, mohammed hasan one of the refugee and uh, he challenged us on when capital goods and the money moves so softly across the world why is that a big number of refugees are stuck in the camp for more than 20 years and uh, our colleague was shocked and uh, the idea came uh, immediately on how to start step up so he, we stepped up and we made contact with the kakuma refugee camp uh, stakeholders we met this team you can see on the picture which is uh, ure and then we all uh, agree sorry sorry jamari sorry jamari i don't think we can see your screen actually so can you try sharing it again yeah let me try i don't know why joel i'm right right you know i don't think you are yeah, yeah. able to see. yeah 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 no no Suddenly, i'm not able to see yeah i'm not able to see as well what should you do for me please i don't know okay okay i i will do it for you i will do it for you yeah okay just tell me when to move it okay yeah yeah you you were here right yeah i am on the slide do we have pictures of who uh, the who who and yeah yeah i have put that picture i have picture sorry joel can you see that picture where i am yeah. i am on that whole picture yeah okay cool sure i can see the picture here yeah. But I'm wondering how you know how I'm moving. Next, just say next, and then they will help you. Yeah, you say next. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We took the idea of skilling refugees and connecting them to opportunities that pay, and uh, uh, we really appreciate the way the unitarian stakeholders in Kakuma they just give us that access. Next, together we decided to skill refugees on social media marketing. but currently we are doing two things social media marketing which is the one to one uh, one to many and the social media selling which is the one to one uh, we started with five refugees in our in our first pilot uh, you can see them on the picture with Joel Angi Paul Padje Yasmin Mohammed Ana Hydrogen and then yeah then but currently we are now 50 strong and on our way to become 500 by 2020 we designed we designed and executed a step by step for training in social media marketing next and uh, we are using the top design agencies tool to deliver professional services among them we have uh, hotspot for uh, hotspot limin pub to get video zapia clickup and canva we train them to use the right platform to deliver the right impact for ev- uh, every individual client here i can tell you that you know we don't uh, just choose the, the the social media platform randomly we first know which kind of business are you running either it's a b2b business or b2c business we can be able to identify which social media will be beneficial for your product uh, for your business and the, the campaign you want to run so in summary we deliver two case services as i said before the social media marketing and the social media selling i can tell you brief about this many people they can be aware of social media marketing but you are doing social media selling 
Uh, if I can be able to share the story that uh, we're faced with our client that is Prey, uh, which is a company selling the cosmetics, Joel, are you together? Yes, sure, are you? Yeah, I was, uh, we, at Step Up, we were considered ourselves as we have felt uh, when we have run campaign for the first month, but there is no any conversion. But the feedback mm -hmm. from the client was like, no, 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 no. It was fine because if we compare the previous experience where we have paid some advertising fee and this one I can say now we have succeeded because many people have connected to our IRED tool and this was really a good feedback that made me wonder. So we do mm -hmm. one scenario which is the uh, when we are running this uh, social media, the, the selling pipe through selling the, the LinkedIn, LinkedIn sell pipeline, we just deliver one scenario in two, in seven steps, which is number one is to identify your, your context and objective. Number two, which is to reframe the objective into a powerful story. And then uh, we do it together with you. Number three is to convert the story into a compelling video. We do professional video using the among the two that I mentioned before, which is Women Five, and uh, mm -hmm. to help you identify the target audience according to your objective. And uh, these we are able to get the audience that are likely to to buy and likely to show interest on your, whatever you are. Uh, service is or product and uh, mm -hmm. we have day-to-day uh, -day activities to connect uh, with those uh, identified the clients then we engage with them whoever who connect back and they show interest we just engage with them and they this in cooperation with you and uh, uh, we consider we'll succeed when we got maybe 30 percent conversion uh, through our way of doing the social media marketing or social media uh, scale. So this is all about about step up dot one. Mm -hmm. Unless you have something you can tell me. Yeah, yeah sure. I have uh, just just one question. Uh, sorry, yeah. Jean-Marie. I saw the some platform on social media that you normally use, but I was keen to know since I'm also in this field of marketing. And um, we all know that uh, we have different social media platform that people use and they prefer one uh, or not another. So some people, especially here in the US, I don't know if you know TikTok, is it in Africa? I, I guess it's there. So uh, TikTok, is, it's a platform that um, young people use. And uh, I was wondering if you can also, uh, in the platform that you use, you can include that in case we request it, or it's, it's not something that you can cover? Yes, sure, thank you very much. And uh, as you've mentioned, TikTok is more social and it's currently used by many youth and uh, drugs. Uh, but we currently not yet use the TikTok, but what I believe, what TikTok is doing, Instagram, Facebook, mm -hmm. and, YouTube, and uh, we have a great experience using Instagram and uh, Facebook. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, this is what we can use uh, for your campaign, which is selling too. If uh, I can mm -hmm. understand clearly that your business is a business to consumer, which can use Facebook and Instagram, and uh, this can just convert uh, more drive to your product. Okay, okay, guys. Uh, oh, Jamari, that was an amazing pitch, actually, Jamari. It was really nice. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm just uh, really amazed. All Jamari did was just read the slides. <laughs> you know, uh, <laughs> all, all he did was, you know, read the slides. But because he read the slides so nicely and uh, simply, I felt, you know, he did a fantastic job. I don't know what, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Paul... Uh, Yasmin, what do you guys think? I mean, I really thought, you know, this pitch was so clear. What do you guys think? Yeah, let them have a feedback. And they, I uh, 
Sorry, negative side. The way I was. Yes, yes, Paul. What do you what what did you think, Paul? You know, I thought uh, Jamari's speech was very nice, actually. But Paul, what did yes. you think, Paul Yasmin? I found to his speech to be very amazing, and also I liked the way he gave the feedback from previous clients, and also he gave the he connected with the clients because he showed the client that he has experience and he has been doing this, and also will be doing this, and also yeah. mm-hmm. he engaged with the clients at the at the every time he was checking up with the client, he asked Joel, "How is it, sir?" So we we'll just confirmed. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Yes. Are we together? Is very good. Yes. Absolutely. Very good. Yes, Paul. Fantastic feedback. Uh, and you, you have really, uh, really Anis, listened to. Mm-hmm. Yes, Joel. Anis, I have a question. In as much as we are trying to say, Jamari, you did a very wonderful job. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much, Jamari. But I think it's it's all it's for all of us. Uh, try to make sure, like, to go through your presentation. Like, let me say a day before. Why am I saying this? Because Jamari did one thing that was like I was laughing, and then I had to meet myself. It was like by 2020 we want to like to reach 500 <laughs> people, and I'm like we are in 2021. <laughs> so which 2020 are you talking about? So no, 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 I think that was really... <laughs> yeah, yeah. no, no. That was just a mistake, we, you know. He read the exactly. Slide. We are all <laughs> yeah. You know, if I show the same slide. He didn't say 2022. He should have said 2022. So he said 2020. So I was like, yeah, okay. Yeah. I just kept quiet. <laughs> so I think I think it's really important just to go through since, in as much as you are confident and you know what you'll talk about, just I be agree. keen when you are reading, <laughs> and uh, look at those small details because it's all about business and just small mistake and you know someone will be like what are you talking about and <laughs> and there are points that are going down and mm. you, you like it or not so just consider that thank you that the only feedback thank i have you, that's a, really that's a good feedback yeah. that's a very good feedback anything else um, uh, bahana yasmin shem shem you know you can actually give feedback you know lots of people give feedback to you actually you know it's your turn to give feedback there is jason jason is gone missing oh jason is here yes jason shem bahana isra what did you think of your brother jo mari <laughs> looks like jo mari you did a so amazing job that everybody is very quiet <laughs> no, no, you did mistake to just comment at the face <laughs> uh, yeah i should just uh, said uh, wait tell wait till everybody says you know okay um see uh, jamari you know your presentation really opened my eyes you know for one thing i was you know you remember jason was telling that you know um uh, you know shem was you know reading the um, you know he was reading the slide i think i am actually convinced now that you have to read the slide at least you know like this so uh, you know uh, uh, hi my name is bahana i am one of the step up one refugee uh, graduate leaders from the kokuma refugee camp um we are step up dot one so so i'm thinking joel you know correct me if i'm wrong um we have to first read that slide okay first one minute just read the slide okay and then add one sentence mm-hmm. okay that that sentence is this so in this slide we are saying hi my name is bahana i am a step up one refugee graduate uh, leader from kakuma refugee camp we started step up dot one nearly 2 years ago uh, reskilling refugees and connecting them to opportunities at pay uh, we believe access to education and access to opportunities is a fundamental human right so we believe access to education and fundamental human right is the is the one extra statement you know b- b- previously yeah. i read i read everything that was on the slide and then i added one extra statement okay so in this one i can say uh, in 2019 mohammed hasan challenged everybody sitting in davos you know to help him ac- get access to a marketable skill and connect him to connect him and the 185000 refugees uh, to global opportunities that actually pay you know so that was the thing you know i'm reading this thing right um and then you can say uh, this inspired 
you know a whole bunch of us to get together and to start step up dot one right after the davos meeting in 2019 so that was the extra sentence okay uh, the third one uh, once you come to this slide you say together we stepped up and we you know uh, spoke with the authorities at the kakuma refugee camp in kenya you are seeing the picture of the uh, camp in this picture um we spoke to the uh, you know leaders of the camp uh, we pitched the idea of reskilling refugees and connecting them to you know opportunities at pay uh, you know to all of these leaders uh, in this picture they they and then you add this picture they really love the idea right uh, they felt that uh, earning and learning should be connected together right if you don't learn with an intention to earn very quickly then uh, the learning becomes completely useless so so this is an extra two lines we can add after this together we 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 we, we looked upon many opportunities uh, but uh, we decided that we will start with social media marketing why because social media marketing is one of the uh, jobs that we see exploding in the market you know so that is the one extra line so basically joel what i'm saying is read the sentence add one extra sentence read the sentence add one extra sentence one or two or three but one is good what do you guys think any any comments on that uh, bahana uh, what do you guys think joel no no i think what totally okay. making sense cuz when you are used to like the floors when you know meeting clients so i think it's uh, it's something that will be helpful and it will just flow but i just to flow based on what you you have on the powerpoints this is it's, it's a, like a guideline on what we will add after that yeah yeah no i agree uh, because then it's uh, easy nobody needs to prepare anything you know slide has the first line you have the second line slide as a first line you have the second line slide as a first line you have the second line yes, and I then agree. you just click 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 yes jamari go ahead yeah uh, i totally agree with what you say but we don't need to completely read we have to prepare that word prepare should stay there you read and they read and they read then uh, as they, they what i used like for the previous it's only i didn't get another more time as a joel identified mm. you read and then you see the picture so you you put in your mind when i see this picture what does this picture tell what should i say about this picture you see when you you go to maybe to this picture where we can see those leaders in kakuma refugee camp you can know that are the people who gave access and is to be able to identify even refugees so then those words there they will help in any case you forget you are a human being you can just think where i am so the the slide where you are the 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 the, the right things will remind you what to say yes absolutely no i i think i really thanks to the advice uh, you know uh, you what you because what you did did not really open my doors it's we have to do exactly like what you did read the slide add a point one point or two points right it doesn't matter because you know we need to add more points if we, if we are in the last slide then we need to add lot of points right uh, especially even here i feel it's very boring you know this one is very boring because you are stopping here and you are explaining all the seven points okay i think we need to have a example of uh, each of these steps quickly so that you go like 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 like that you know so each point is like you know quickly uh, come to the people can only see you know really quickly so i'll try to do that um, you know before our next meeting yeah. okay um i think uh, we are done with uh, this week next week uh, next week who's going to pitch uh, i already know bahana is going to pitch because i put his name uh, bah- bahana you are okay right next week yeah no problem i'll pitch <laughs> before you come you know hopefully bahana i will we'll try to create uh, you know the slide deck you know 
um like ha- to, to have all the pictures so you know the slide deck is actually pitching for you you know even if you keep quiet even if you keep quiet and simply just keep moving the you know uh, moving the something like this right you know you keep moving the slide and it is talking to the person right you just keep quiet just keep moving like this and it is the, talking to the person just keep moving I agree with you. Actually, my the way I always do my pitch is not far away. It's not uh, different from my what uh, you know uh, my colleague has just done previously. So you know, just adding a few points here and there. But I mean, absolutely the same thing. You just stick on the presentation, but yeah. you just add one or two points. Just to, yeah. You know, yeah. And read, and read. yeah. No, I didn't. I didn't really realize it until I saw Jean Marie because you know he, when I pitch also right, I put the slide and I keep going. Uh, I keep talking about something. You know. uh i always you know just and that's why my meeting takes so much time i never stick to the presentation you know uh, unfortunately okay who is going to do next week guys uh, who else uh, we need to, two three more people for next week jo- joel joel will be our uh, you know client because she is the best in imagining client scenarios shoe carpet marketing <laughs> joel <laughs> Joel keeps moving from Nigeria, UK, US. You can see, you can see how he, he brought the, he brought the idea of bringing the TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no. I thought the TikTok TikTok was a fantastic uh, question, and you answered it also brilliantly. Sure. When 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 you don't do something right, you you should be able to say we don't do it. Don't try to be don't try to be you know uh, uh, nice. and say oh we can try to do that for you okay don't ever say that we say we don't do tiktok full stop we have learned from you how you do you to say <laughs> <laughs> okay uh, okay next week who's going to do it guys come on uh, we i've also got i've got bahana who else is there next week we need three more people as yes, you know it was fun guys i mean shem Shem did it. Shem don't know anything about what we do, but Shem was able to do it. So what about Jason? You know, Jason, can you do next week? Yeah, it's okay, Anis. Uh, I will do it next week. <laughs> okay, good. Uh, what about our friend Paul? Paul, uh, Paul, and uh, who else is there? Uh, no guys you know you look at the spirit of uh, you know shem right you know he came in last week and he said he will do it this week and he did a decent job so who who's want to do westin is that was on the list huh? last week whose name was there isra isra oh yeah where the hell is she she ran away <laughs> 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 I think you know. No, I'm going to put Isra's name right now. Okay. I mean, you know. Yeah, Isra is going to be somebody. I have to tell Isra that she has to do it. Okay. So Bahana, Jason, Isra. What about Paul? Paul, can you try next week? I'm not sure yet because I have an issue accessing my devices. Oh, is it okay? But you know, yeah. Okay, that's okay, Paul. see uh, yeah. you need to have a laptop you know otherwise it is very hard to present if you don't have a laptop i can do it for you and then you can you can you know just speak uh, you can only speak and i will just keep moving the screen like i did for joel sorry uh, jamari yeah. okay i need one more person guys come on who is it um where are the ladies you know we need two ladies and two boys i mean what about yasmin yasmin Ah, oh, come on. Who, oh, who else can do it? Uh, I can do it. I can. I can try. Seems to. Okay, Joel. Okay. Yeah, Joel. Yeah, we'll take you actually. Yeah. So you play the client, and then, and then we will ask, uh, you know, uh, John Marie to play the client next time. So you know, you can be the pitcher. Okay. So okay. it's Bahana, Jason, Isra, and Joel. Okay. So what i will do uh, between now and next week is um, i will uh, i will try to you know uh, make the pitch you know like a story that you can tell um, 
and i will also see if i can uh, you know make that pitch myself and keep it as a recording you know uh, for everybody okay cool uh, we'll do that any 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 other uh, job any other questions anybody have you know uh, normal operational things any any questions see one good thing between last week and this week is you know we have that uh, you know that bumper uh, thing uh, bahana has got like you know like three new jobs and jamari has got two jobs um, so it's uh, you know but they have not yet come to us you know uh, we have not yet closed it uh, but they have promised they both have said you know they will do it so i hope you know they will keep their promise um uh but uh, yeah i mean you know going forward you know this is the this is what you know the moment we start going to the uk switzerland us clients uh, we can close not just one client but you know we can close you know uh, two three jobs uh, you know per meeting you know we don't need to do just one job per meeting you know it can be two jobs three jobs four jobs per meeting so yeah uh, any questions uh, from anybody ahmed uh anybody has any question shem do you have any question jason anything you guys have operationally uh uh for me it's it's actually uh i just want to say that i have uh, learned a lot from uh, jamari what jamari did it was actually you know perfect and uh, uh some of the mistakes i made on my pitch i think uh and uh, next time uh, i should uh, you know do something that is uh, somehow that you know true. presentable that is true shem you know because um, i also learned so much from jean marie's speech because it was very easy to understand you know uh, kisha was like you know going like a train you know it was like so fast uh, it was a lot of passion but i had i i find it extremely difficult to you know follow uh, but um, and i sometimes think i also talk like kisha you know very fast i keep pitching and running very fast um, but jamari was very slow you know very slow just the slide will come and then he will read the slide <laughs> right and i found uh, that approach to be very calming very calming very simple and uh, there was no there was no hurry in his voice you know uh, in your voice shem in kisha's voice in my voice even in joel's voice you know there is a lot of um, we 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 talk really fast you know like ta 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 really fast but when you slow it down when you really slow it down it it brings a lot of confidence in the way uh, you know the the other people will perceive you know um, so that that's really good actually so i felt it was i learned a lot from shamari today i hope all of us learn um, any any other um, things uh, bahana you need to really decide quickly you know uh, who your from your team is going to work next time but other than that i think we are good um um so for uh, shem and all the new people right you know i am actually trying to prepare you know all the videos of the past in in a very simple way right now it is there in my youtube channel but i'm i'm going to you know see if we can um, you know make it easy for everybody to follow uh, so that you know you can when you hire your own uh, when you make your own team then it's easy for you to you know teach them because you know um, where they are etc etc so you know i will i'll do that in the in the due course and uh, i also need to send everybody the new list so that's also there in my head i'll do that also shall we call it a day guys i think you know we have done enough for today uh, lots of pictures uh, if you guys don't have any question you know then i'll call it a day huh? yeah yeah i think we are done for today i don't know uh, yeah two hours my head is spinning right now <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Yeah. Okay. Bye, everybody. Bye. 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 Bye.